Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. Clicked on to Long Range Weather Forecast Gushin for December 12th to 24th. There's been a lot of wild swings in the temperature forecast, and followed by a few days of cold, then a warm and cold again. And that, that'll seem to continue for the rest of the month. As the NAO, we're going to take a look at that first. The NAO is positive and remains positive, maybe starts tending um, negative late in the period, but overall it is positive. And the AO is positive, both well, a trends negative, maybe indication of um, maybe some more Arctic air coming into the east. And the PNA is generally positive. So we're expecting a lot of temperature changes, and like I said, but the overall trend uh, doesn't look like it's going to change very much. Okay, we're going to look at the period now for December 12th to 16th. And we have an upper low that remains near Hudson Bay. And we this will remain in place for the foreseeable future with the upper low near the Aleutians. And a ridge to the south, we have a ridge here. And a trough forecast across the north central states. You can see right here, we have a little bit of a ridge here across the western Atlantic. But overall, it means the same. Now, in this period, uh, energy will exit the southern Rockies and will lift towards the northeast and interact with northern stream flow over the eastern U.S. I'll take a look at that. And this could bring heavy rain to the to the um, eastern U.S. up through the Appalachians Friday into Saturday. So here we are Friday, and you can see now we're going to Saturday. We can see here's the rain. This is GFS. Most of the cold air and snow remains here. And then we look at the European. Again, showing a lot of heavy rain across the eastern U, uh, eastern states. Now, um, this system will interact with lower atmospheric cold air damming and could lead to interior snow and ice threat in the northeast. It will become unsettled in the west later in the week as Pacific energy and high falls push inland. So now we shift to the west. You start seeing um, here, here's a low and we have snow across this area here. And then it remains through snow Friday and Saturday. So you can see the pattern right there. And moderate heavy snow will develop with the position as it progresses east inland, especially uh, for the favorite terrains of the North Central Great Basin, Rockies later in the week through the weekend. And you can see right here. Okay, we're going to look now for the period for December 15th to 19th. And the pattern doesn't change very much from the previous period. And the upper low remains near Green, uh, Greenland, near Hudson Bay. We have an upper low near the Aleutian still. Here it is right here. Oops. And we have a ridge to the south and over the western Atlantic. You see the ridge here. And we have a trough that moves into the north central states again. So miles of pretty good agreement on this overall. So for this forecast period, I am forecasting above normal temperatures here and for this region. And a forecast in numbers of two to four degrees above normal. Below normal temperatures of forecast here, and I'm forecasting anomalies of two to four degrees below normal. For precipitation, oh, yeah, for precipitation, calling for above normal precipitation for the Rockies and for this region. And I'm forecasting probability of occurrence is 35 to 40%. And then we have below normal precipitation here, and the probability of occurrence is 35%. Getting to um, the next part of the 
forecast period is for December 20th to 24th, um, Christmas Eve. Uh, this is what I'm forecasting the pattern to look like. Uh, most of the models are showing a zone of flow overall across the nation with a trough in the west and above normal heights in the east. So weather will be generally not as extreme probably by this period. And um, so for this forecast period, I'm forecasting above normal temperature for this area here. And I'm forecasting numbers of two degrees above normal. Then that doesn't mean that there won't be any cold weather during this time, because the trend of the the um, as long as the NAO remains positive, uh, overall it'll, be, it'll change from warm to cold, warm to cold. So the anomalies here are low, meaning two degrees above normal for precipitation. Call for below normal precipitation for the west. Probability of occurrence is 35%. Then we have above normal precipitation from the uh, Mississippi Valley to the Atlantic Coast. Probability of occurrence is 40%. That's the long range weather forecast discussion for December 12th to 24th. Thanks for coming to Jim Unley's World of Weather and have a good day.